have a Lexus RX 350, one of the reasons that you probably bought it is because of this back door. And in this video, I'm going to show you a few things that you need to know about the back door that's going to make your ownership experience of your RX even better. Now there's more than one way to open the rear door. You can open it with your hand as long as the key fob is on you by touching a little button under the Lexus emblem with the key fob on me. You can also use your key fob right there remotely. Just press the button. And now I'm gonna use the touch-free power rear door feature with the key fob on me. But first, I wanna show you how not to use this feature. Do not place your hand on the emblem. Will not work. Do not wave your hand in front of the emblem like you just saw your long lost, um, do not, do not wave your hand in, don't wave your hand in front of the emblem. Don't hold it too far away. I guess that's about it. You're gonna to wanna to hold it about an inch away, right over the emblem with your palm, basically covering the L. And just hold it there. But you can also press and hold, it's a long press. So if the door is closed, you just press and hold. Then if the door is open, you press and hold again and it'll close it. I'm gonna be using this multi-directional keypad along with the selection button there in the middle to change the settings that you're about to see. I'm pressing right and I'm gonna go over to settings. It's the little gear icon. And then I'm gonna to go to vehicle settings and press M. And there's PBD and that's power back door. Press M and then press system settings, all on. You wanna make sure that that is what you see. If I press in and it says touchless sensor off, that means that the touch-free power rear door function will not operate. I'm gonna go opening adjustment, press in, and I can adjust the setting for it, three, uh, five, four, three, two, one. That's the maximum height, that's the minimum height. And now I'm gonna customize the opening height with a push button on the bottom side of the door itself. Remember, there's one of two ways you can do that with that push button, but also with the selector inside the vehicle that I showed you just a second ago. Watch this. I'm gonna close it. And now I'm gonna open it again. And it will open to the height I just memorized. Coolest thing ever. Okay, everybody. I think that just about does it for all things power rear door in the Lexus RX 350. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, Give it a big fat thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you would like to see more videos like this delivered to you hot off the press as soon as I make it. Also, hit that little bell button so that whenever I make a new video, you'll get a notification. And the most important thing of all, please have a wonderful day, everybody.